going on YouTube? This your man, Jehovah. Just checking in once again. Hey, man, I want to talk about Boosie. Boosie and Lil Nas X. Now, the beef with them two is, I think Boosie don't like the fact that Lil Nas is promoting an agenda that we all see. Good. And Lil Nas X is trolling Boosie because Boosie don't like the agenda that we see in every day. So, I, don't, I ain't know how it happened, so I'm just scrolling and I see Boosie trending, right? So I click to see what's going on. So I see a lot of people saying, <laughs> they be going on my boy Boosie. They be saying, uh, Boosie, wake up thinking about Lil Nas X. What straight man think about a gay man all day? He's down low. Man, Boosie ain't down low at all, bro. But I get the jokes. You know what I'm saying? I'm here for the jokes that I understand totally. Uh, but Boosie ain't, uh, ain't, uh, like that, you know what I mean, but he do express himself, and uh, you gotta think, y'all, Boosie from the South, man, where I'm from, I'm from Mississippi, he from Louisiana, so we have a different outlook on homosexuality than most people do, you gotta think, we come from the Bible Belt, so we got that going on for us too, you know what I'm saying, so a lot of people are taught that homosexuality is bad, you know, so it's just more so of a down South cultural thing on how we was raised as black people, uh, we never hurt gay people, it's, it's rare that you hear any gay crimes that happen in the south like that you know most of it be amongst the gay community you know you hear a lot of trans or gay people getting murdered uh in black areas most of it be from bisexual men as known as down low black men that are killing the transgender community but you don't hear too many heterosexual black men killing anybody from the lgbt it used to be the the uh the people that's within sometimes you know that uh that's with their lifestyle so I think a lot of people get it misconstrued that, you know, heterosexual black men are beating it or doing things to the transgender community or to the LGBT, and that's not true. Most of the time, you just think about it, you know, they always say the down low, down low, down low is bisexual. We can cut it, slice it, slice it all we want, but it is bisexual. But uh, on Lil Nas X part, you know, he's a gay, proud gay man. Uh, he want to rep what he rep. And he trolling and it looks, looked like he having fun with it, you know, but I guess uh, what got Boosie upset was Lil Nas X made a video or something saying that, hey, I'm making a video with Boosie. Uh, I'm not video, but I'm doing a song with Boosie and I can't wait till it come out. So I guess Boosie got upset and made, the, you know, made his, uh, made his tweet. So this is the tweet he said. Boosie, I, this was an hour ago prior to me making this video. He was like, stop trolling me. F word, LOL. You a whole B word, playing with the gangster, shaking my head. You can keep sucking D and getting F'd in your A in peace and pound. You hate yourself. I would too if I was you, LOL, Nas X. If you commit suicide, you would do the world a huge favor and nobody wants you here. So that was his response to Lil Nas X. But my thing is, bro, Boosie, as a Bro, I, I'm with you, brother. I'm, I've been riding with you this whole time. But, hey, uh, this is a situation that's kind of weird because, man, you speak enough for the, what everybody else been thinking. But at the end of the day, man, people going to say you wrong. And I hate for you to get in a cross with the industry. I hate for you to get in a cross with the powers that be. These folks are powerful, my G. And you a good dude. Like, you the last of a dying brick. Man, hold on, y'all. It is hot, man. My AC went out. So... And it's light, hot as hell. So I had to get another light. Man, it's hot as hell up here. So, but anyway, but Boosie, <clears throat> Lil Nas X is a uh, is an entertainer. Uh, every year we have, I mean, every thing like every five years we have a new agenda. You know what I'm saying? So Lil Nas X may be a part of it. Uh, but man, he just gonna troll you, bro. Like the madder you get, the more he gonna come up with the jokes. You know what I'm saying? Then everybody that support him. They gonna come up with jokes. Some of the jokes be funny as hell. I ain't gonna start to you. But I do uh, hope Boosie just leave that man alone. Let that man say what he gonna say. We all know what type of man you is, Boosie. You know what I mean? So don't let this shit uh, ruin your money and take your freedom. Because they gonna find something. They gonna figure out something. Because they mad because you ain't signed to an industry. They mad because you, you're a boss ass dude. They mad because you don't need nobody. Like you make your own music all that come back to you you just did a movie which i truly love and everybody need to go check it out uh you did your own independent film so most of the money you make come back to you you know so they mad that they can't really get a piece of it. 
and you just keep staying on that path, my black man, because you playing with these folks like that, man, they gonna get you, and they will get you, you know, and uh, to Lil Nas X, hey, you keep doing what you doing, but, you know, Lil Nas X ain't in the circles where Boosie and them be at, you know what I'm saying, so Boosie don't even need to worry about that. Just take this as publicity, getting fans and stuff like that, and you don't have to bow down to that dude. You know, one day maybe y'all run into each other, and you find out Lil Nas X not really gay. Because I don't think he gay. I ain't going to lie to you. I think he's trolling everybody. Uh, I don't think he gay. Because I remember when, before Old Town Road came out, when it first came out, before he came out as a gay person, I was looking at his old videos. And I didn't peep none of the gay stuff. I was shocked as hell. Well, you know what? When he came out, I wasn't shocked because that's when I started seeing him wear the pink, uh, with the pink cowboy outfit and stuff. So I started to see that, and I was like, "Damn, you know, maybe he is gay." But the more I watch him, I'm like, "Well, maybe he bisexual, or he, you know, something like that." But maybe he trolling all of us. We don't know, man. This the entertainment world, and uh, Boosie is underground. Boosie don't need. None of these folks, bro. And uh, I hope Booster keep his mouth closed, man. I know it's hard, man, when folks playing with your manhood, playing with your brand, playing with your name. But at the same time, bro, sometimes we got to look at it like this. This they shit right now, man. And they are in control. And sometimes, man, you just got to salute them. You know, sometimes we can't win every war. And some wars we just got to be like, you know what? This motherfucker got me. You know what I mean? This motherfucker got me. And, um. I never listened to Lil Nas song. Maybe, you know, I see, you know, trending and stuff, but, hey, man, motherfuckers, they, they, to the rest of y'all, motherfuckers think Lil Nas a little nigga. That motherfucker big as shit now. That motherfucker look like he about six four, and he ain't no little nigga, so you run up on him think he a bitch ass nigga. Please, black folk, uh, don't get whooped, man, because if you get whooped by Lil Nas X, man, it's going to be so funny. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to lie. Besides Boosie, you know, Boosie got his goals. They ain't worried about Boosie getting touched. But if a regular person talk that F word stuff to Lil Nas X to his face and Lil Nas X whoop your ass, it's going to be funny. I ain't going to lie. But anyway, y'all, y'all salute. Uh, subscribe, like, man. Fuck with your boy, man. Pray for me, man. It is hot than a motherfucker up in here. They still working on my AC, so I can hear them now. They just start working on it. So uh, hopefully, man, I get some air in this Texas goddamn heat. So, uh, y'all be safe and uh, salute. Love everybody.